So what about the tariffs today? What is being talked about? What is uh, being thought? And to be sure and to be fair, uh, the short answer is we don't know because it's changing on a day-to-day -day basis and sometimes on a tweet-to-tweet -tweet basis. <laughs> but at least what most people think is going to happen from what has been said so far, impact to our GDP, the economy, the gross domestic product, all of the goods and services in the United States of about 0.1 to 0.2 percent. To put that level in some context, economists think that our economy will grow by 2.5 to 3 percent this year. So 0 0.1, 0 0.2 over a base of 2.5 to 3, not terribly material for the economy as a whole. Having said that, there are particular areas of the economy that are expected to be more affected than others. For instance, how many of you own electronic devices? <laughs> One, two, three of you. Okay. Right. So for those three people in the audience, uh, people are expecting that your prices may rise as much as 15%. And for those people who grow soybeans in Illinois, you could see your revenues drop by 13%. So again, grand scheme of things, not so much impact, particular areas of the market considerably impacted. So when we think about the economy and we take a step back, what are we seeing today? I mentioned expectations are for growth in the economy of 25 to 3%. In a vacuum, 25 to 3% would be a good number. And think about that in the context of the ninth year of a recovery. So very strong. The other thing to note when you look at this slide, uptick most recently. And John's going to talk about the impact that we're seeing in expectations for earnings and stocks. But suffice it to say that the tax cut that was implemented this year is having a positive and stimulative effect on the economy. 